It is a photo that has sparked a big discussion online. Jerry Jones at age 14 watching as a group of white students harass and deny six African-American students from entering the school. It just recently resurfaced. And now this morning, some of the sports world's biggest stars are weighing in. Suzanne Bruner is following the reaction on social media. Suzanne. Doug Prescott chiming in too. Yeah, as you can see, Kara, this story getting a lot of attention on WFAA.com right now. Reporters asked Dak about this picture of a then 14 year old Jerry Jones. You can see circled here in red. Here's a portion of what Dak had to say. I'm here for growth and giving grace and, and trying to make this world a better place. And that's who I am in my, at my core and all I believe in. And um, yeah, unfortunate things come up from the past pictures and, and they show um, they show how far we've come, but in the same sense, they're a reminder of, of um, how, or how what? Uh, wounds or? Yeah, or just how short of a time that was ago. Yeah, and Dak had so much to say. This photo has more people from the sports world talking this morning. LeBron James actually turned a post game news conference around Wednesday night asking reporters about the picture and compared the situation with Kyrie Irving. He felt the story was buried in the news cycle while Irving's social media posts linking to a documentary with anti Semitic themes were constantly brought up. But it seems like to me that the whole Jerry Jones situation photo, and I know it was years and years ago, and we all make mistakes. I get it. But it seemed like it's just been buried under like, oh, it happened. OK, we just we just move on. And I was just kind of disappointed. That I haven't received that question from you guys. Looking on social media this morning, seeing many of you reacting to the story on our Facebook page, uh, some agreeing with Dak, others also reacting to Jerry Jones's comment about the picture, saying that was 65 years ago. Curious kid. I didn't know at the time the monumental event that was going on. I'm sure glad we're a long way from that. You can read Dak's full statement by finding the story on our website, WFAA.com. Guys, back to you.